We're down at the Nolichucky River in Tennessee. And this is the sluice. We're going to try to catch some Helgramites. Normally we seen them, but in this case, we might be able to find them under rocks. So let's go get some. Here's our first Helgramite. This is a little creature. We're going to try to find some bigger ones. But this is a carnivore type creature that will bite you. As you can see, the pinchers there, they also have a hook on their tail and they will come around and bite you like that right there. But that's our first Helgramite. Now we're going to catch some more. Okay, this is what we call a river crayfish. They're hard shell. But the fish will bite them, but they're not the best bait to use. You notice they got these pinchers out here. Ow! Ow, ow! But they will pinch you, and that they're nice little critters to play with. Would you like to play with it? Okay, let's get some more. Bye-bye in the wild. Okay, we found another one. He's a little bit bigger. And you notice when you catch these things, they have hooks on them, and they will come around and pinch, ain't you? But uh, when you lay them down, you always grab them by the head, They'll try to pull around by you, but they can't, so hold them around the neck. All right, let's get some more. All right, we have a wolf spider down in here somewhere, right there. What we call a mean-looking wolf spider. Right there. That's huge. It looks like a little giant tarantula. Also, we have another crayfish. Put a couple little rocks down in there. Yeah, it's huge. Get out of there, boy. Daddy, Come on, get out of there. Get out of there. Can you see that? Ow! Yeah, we see it. There might be some hell lights down here. Sometimes they dig their ways down in here. But I don't see any. Okay, we found another big one here. Now that's more like it right there. That's almost a T-bone steak to a smallmouth bass. Over and out. Alright, we got two big ones this time. Good show, mates. Alright, there's what we're looking for, folks. A real big one. Like I said, they'll, ow! they'll bite you. Froggy! Yep. Oh! It's not what I was looking for, but... We got it. Yeah. Here's one. This one's a big one. Let me stop it, please. Oh! There's a lizard. A lizard? Yeah. Talking to me. Hello, folks. Good morning, ain't it? Yep. Well, see you later. Okay, here we are on the banks of the Nolichucky River. We're going to set some rods out here with some worms and try to catch some catfish. And we're going to, if we look up this way, you can see the shoals up here. Now that's where the smallmouth bass are out there. We're going to take some helgramites and we're going to Go out there around the edges and we're going to see what happens. Good deal. Okay, here we go. Now we got the Helgramites, and as you can see back here, we got our rods out here ready for some catfish. We also put some of those hard shell crayfish on there, so we hope to catch a lot of fish today. It's awful hot. It's not always a good thing, but we're going to do it anyway. I'm going to go over here and try to catch some smallmouth bass. The way you hook these Helgramites is they got a little collar. You take the hook. You stick right down in that collar, real easy. You don't want to kill them. And you just kind of hook it right in that little collar and you pull it right back out. They won't sling off and they usually don't die until you catch a fish. They're really hard nosed critters. Let's go catch some. And that, my friends, is what the Helgramite will do. He's a little bit bleeding there, but he'll be all right. Good deal. We got some bluegill here. They bite bluegills too. That must be what he's eating our bait. It's a little bit hot today. They're not biting as quick as usual, but we're doing a good job. That other line. God, he's a good one. Well, wait, hang on a second. 
Okay, this is downstream. Beautiful looking area. There's a cliff that a lot of people like to jump off of. They're crazy because there's rocks under there. Right up there is where the old smallmouth live. And if you look upstream, you can see white water up there, a little bit of rough water right below there is a good place to fish too. Great place to fish, great clean stream, and full of helgramites and catfish and all kinds of good fish. Good to go.